So welcome back to the channel. This week on the channel we're going to do Agfa Chrome CT100 slide film. Now this expired in 1998. My daughter Georgia took these images on her Canon EOS 600. I'm going to show these images while giving a brief history on this Agfa slide film. If you like to learn and be inspired, join me on a quest of creativity. Explore film, alternative processes and digital. Please subscribe and hit that notification button to get the latest videos every week. I'm going to talk a little bit about Agfa Chrome CT100. Agfa have been producing color transparency films since the 1930s. Now the first of these was the Agfa Color Noi. Now it wasn't until the 80s when they started to make E6 chemistry based films the Agfa Chrome CT100. This of course was superseded by Agfa's Precisa brand. Numerous improvements was made to the CT100 such as the CT100i and the CT100x. I wish to concentrate on the original CT100. It was squarely aimed at marketing towards consumers. Sold in single packs, rarely sold in three packs or more. Now at the time Diaz which comes from diapositives, as they're known in Germanic speaking countries such as Germany, Austria and Switzerland, were extremely popular throughout the 90s, well into the 2000s. Even here in Austria, folks still have their slides stored away in the basements. If you search on eBay or on willhaven.at, you will find heaps of stuff when you search for dia. Dia film, dia projector, dia slides, that's why I ended up having this film. Now I'm gonna open it up here, all right. Let's put the box out of the way. CT100, 27 exposures. It's got three extra exposures on this little film. Ah, uh, wow. This is a relic from the 80s. We're gonna make some images from this, so let's do that. already subscribed please hit that subscribe button don't forget to hit the little notification bell and hope to see you on the next video goodbye